It's interesting that when I was working on the Mississippi piece, all these tornadoes broke out in Mississippi. I was watching some of the videos on YouTube and with all the tornado activity. It's an atmosphere that's in that piece of music. I think I put it in there unconsciously. I've done that a lot before when I work on atmospheric pieces. They tend to be, I tend to use a lot of reverb on the guitars and a lot of synth washes and strings and things like that. And I did that a lot on my Virga album, which I put out in 2010. And that was released uh, around this time. It was in March. And there was a track on there. It was called Dreaming of Tornadoes. And I've had a lot of them in the past. I think it's a theme that appears in a lot of people's dreams. There's a fascination with them. You know, the storm chasers have a fascination with them. And now with people that, people with drone cameras and well, just cameras in general are able to um, get footage of all that. And this relates to my disaster movies idea that uh, it's this uh, human fascination with disaster that that draws us in. It's probably happened throughout time before we had any kind of media. People are just fascinated by that kind of thing, and I don't know why, and that's why it turns up in dreams. The engine of dreams are emotions, and they can be all kinds of emotions. They don't necessarily have to be dark. They can be light as well. Um, but I think they're definitely driven by emotions.